Hello and welcome to all. This is up number 8014 and in this video I will talk about EPIRB. An emergency position indicating radio beacon is a safety device carried by a vessel to alert search and rescue services and allow them to quickly locate the person in the event of an emergency. Most EPIRBs operate in the 406 megahertz band. There are two types of 406 megahertz EPIRBs. A category One EPIRB is automatically activated when a ship sinks. These category one EPIRBs are housed in a special bracket equipped with a hydrostatic release. This mechanism releases the EPIRB at a water depth of more than four meters. The EPIRB floats to the surface and starts transmitting. Category one EPIRBs can also be activated manually. A category two EPIRB has to be activated manually. When activated, it transmits a coded message on the 406 megahertz distress frequency, which is monitored by the Cosmos Society Satellite System. The alert is then relayed by an unearthed station to the nearest rescue coordination center. As the satellites are in a polar orbit, they offer true global coverage. With an EPIRB, you can summon help wherever you are on the planet. no matter how remote as you can see in this video that the first the distress message is sent to the cosmos satellite satellite then the, to the lut that is local user terminal then to the mcc that is missile control center then it will send to the rcc rescue coordination center then the search and rescue unit will rescue the vessel which is in distress so this is how epirb works 406 megahertz gps epirb have the following features it should be internationally approved high performance multi channel gps high brightness flashing led light minimum 48 hour continuous operation comprehensive self test facility with battery use indicator manual release bracket this much is important from this video hope you have liked it thank you and subscribe this channel